Have you ever seen an airplane propeller through a phone camera? Because it looks super wrong, but it's actually just super cool. There's two things at play here. The first is shutter speed. Shutter speed is just how long the camera spends taking in light on each frame of the video. Because even though we see a video as a continuous motion, it's actually, as we know, a series of still images. The second thing at play is frame rate, often expressed as frames per second. This is how many images make up each second of the video. So imagine you're taking a video at 24 frames per second, which this video is and what I usually shoot in. I'm currently in 24 frames per second. If you're shooting in 24 frames per second, but the propeller blades are going at a rate of about 25 frames per second, it's going to look like the blades are only moving a tiny bit every frame because they're making just over one full rotation every time you take that picture. The result is that it looks like the propellers are barely moving and it can get even weirder. Depending on the relationship between your frame rate and the propeller blades spinning, it can look like the propellers are moving backwards or if they're completely synced up or a multiple of, it can look like they're not moving at all. The same thing happens with helicopter blades in videos all the time. You've probably seen this effect floating around the internet before and you've probably heard someone talk about it, but you know what? I still think it's super cool.